Happy with the bases loaded. He's 0 for 1 with a fly to right. High fly ball left field. Badu going back on the track. Wow. Leaps up and he can't get it, and that ball is gone, and it's a grand slam. Number three on the year for Rafi. He cleans him off here in Detroit, and the Red Sox bust it open right away. If there's anyone that can hit through the wind, it's Rafi. Holy cow. Ball with a fly ball, more off the end of the bat in the second inning. High oh, fly ball, left wow. center field. This one's jacked. Green racing back. Forget about this one. It's gone. Duvall does it again. A two-run homer. His fourth. He's already driven in 14 runs on the year. And the Red Sox lead it 8 to nothing. This has three hits in the series. Speaking. It's a high fly ball right field. That one carrying back. Back, back, back. And that ball is gone. Raffi for the second time in this game. This one to right field and the Red Sox lead it nine to two his fourth home run of the season. He's driven in five runs today with a lot of time oh. swing and a deep drive. Man did he hit this one way out of here gone. Ryan El Tapia all over that baby the Red Sox with a bunch of home runs today. Four of them on the afternoon to lead it 14 to two. Fly ball to right field. Back goes Acuna Jr. at the wall. That ball is gone. Juan Soto hits his second home run of the year, and the Padres take a 1 0 lead. Soto has had so much success against Morton, and he takes him out of the yard. Padres have a 1 0 lead. What an at bat for Juan Soto. Deer doubled yesterday, also scored a run. Center field. Pache streaking back. That is gone. Into the shrubbery. Dead away center field. Spencer Steer tees off. His second homer on the young year. And the Reds out of the gate have a 1 0 lead. Boy, what a good looking swing by Spencer Steer. Especially when you know the heart rate is high. Rips a ball. Right center field. Babe Outman. Two run shot. Are you kidding me right now? He <laughs> is floating. Cloud nine. This game is not supposed to be that easy. I mean, he is another level, and he's been there now for a while. Fly ball to right field. Geraldo Perdomo. Diamondbacks answer right back. It's 4-3. He has very quietly had a nice offensive start to the year. He really has, and he very quietly had a nice year last year with runners in scoring position. He was a 283 hitter. Nobody. Marte sends one deep to right. Way back and gone. Cattell Marte gives the Diamondbacks the lead. All with two outs, they've gone triple, homer, single, home run. Make it 5 4 D backs. How's that for a comeback? Nice. Yeah, we were speculating when we showed you the Diamondbacks lineup that Cattell Marte might be. Power. Jason Hayward unloads on a ball. If it's fair, it's gone. It's off the pole. A missile of a home run for Hayward. Number three is a Dodger. Just been waiting for this from him, watching batting practice here, the swing that he's had even coming into this weekend. 103 miles an hour off the pole. So here's both against Stan. That is cracked to left field. There it goes. See ya. What a bomb. It is 4 1 Yankees. Wow. 436 feet on the line for John Carlos Stan. In a rocket, his first at bat for a base hit, and now it's in the air out towards left center field. Well struck, and it's gone. Patrick Wisdom will touch them all. And it is 3 1 Cubs. Well, he's off to a real nice start this year. That's home run number three for Patrick against a guy who rarely allows the long ball. To Cubs about hit the uh, Rangers 10 to 5 here today. Jan 
hitless so far. See if he can get on the board. Drill down the left side, curling. Gone. Just into the basket, Jan Gomes. And it is 7 2. Gomes leaves the lot his first of the year. It's this hard to write near the wall, and there it goes, Andrew McCutcheon. Homer's here at PNC Park. Hey, Mom, she was here to see it. Two hundred fourth as a bucko. Garrett, we'll see how good Gomber is off the stretch. That ball driven to deep right center field. Does a back. See you later. Two nights in a row, the Nats blasting homers to break out on top. Stone Garrett, six total bases already. Do it, Stone. Elevate to celebrate a hanging curveball, top of the zone. Two ground outs and a foul out tonight for Mustakis. There we go. Wow, fly ball, deep right field. Moose is loose. First Colorado Rocky home run for Mike Moustakis. And what an at bat by Moose. You can hear the, the crowd saying Moose already. Farmer sends one high and deep to left center field. McCormick drifting, track, wall, gone! Three-run homer for Kyle Farmer. And the Twins have a 3-0 lead here in the second. Oh, what a way to follow up your walk-off hit yesterday. Getting another start against the righty. And takes this ball into the bullpen. Jordan smokes one to right field. That ball's gone. Jordan Alvarez, his third career grand slam, ties it up with one swing. Astros right back in this game thanks to the big man. 14 RBIs on the year. The 1 0 pitch, a swing and a drive, left field and deep. Back it goes and gone. By the time he blinked, that thing was out of here. That was a rocket off his bat. And you're just waiting for one big swing for him to break out on the power side. And this was that swing. Tried to come up under his hands where they were earlier in the ballgame. They didn't get it there. This was center cut and Buck knows what. And Pena drills one deep to left field, and that'll be gone. Jeremy Pena connects on a line drive two run home run and those runs in the bottom of the eighth now really come back to hurt as the Astros put up six. Everybody who's been on base since the second inning has come around to score it's now nine to six as Pena top of the order with the Giants now Lamont Wade Jr. That ball is smoked deep to right field. Adios, Pelota. That one is wet. Little slider, he drops it down and in right at the knees. And Lamont Wood Jr. was looking for it. And he hits it and it stays hit. And we have ourselves the first splash hit of the year. And that's belted to left field, and Bobby Wood Jr. has his second home run of the year. And the Royals are on the board for the first time. Ooh, that was nice. It's just a matter of time before he starts heating up. You keep throwing him those fastballs. He's a good fastball hitter. Thank the Giant fan for throwing it back on the. Ooh, with that downhill angle. Ooh, yeah. Reyes hits it to deep left field, and that's gone. And the Royals have their second home run of the game, their second leadoff home run. Bobby Wood Jr. homered in the sixth. And the Royals get it back to a three run game. Reyes is second. Hit in the air to left field and deep. Back goes Yastrzemski. Goal! Salvi with two strikes and two outs in the eighth inning ties the game at five. Oh, man. A pitch down again. You can't throw him anything down now. He's a money player, believe it, fans. As Bichette sends the ball to center field, well hit. Trout back, and it's gone. Second.
second home run in as many nights for Bo Bichette. And the Blue Jays have a 2 to nothing lead. So here's Matt Chapman. And he sends one high and deep to left field. And this one is going to go. The first of the season for Chapman. And all of a sudden it is four to nothing. Boy is this part of the lineup on an absolute tear to start the season. And this one well hit left center field long run trap. Jumps and it is gone. A good effort by Trout, but he couldn't bring it back. It's a home run for Springer, his first of the. So that bobblehead was moving. Then he foe hits one in the air, pretty deep to left center, all the way back for Varsho at the wall. It's gone. Home run, Luis Renjifo. It's his first of the year. It's an opposite field shot, and the Angels are back within one. Yeah. A rally all the way back, and then some. Trout hammers it left field. That's deep. Merrifield's back. That is gone. Home run, Mike Trout, and the Angels have grabbed the lead in the fifth. It's seven to five. As Mike from Jersey goes over Jersey Mike's for a three-run crusher. Alonzo drives one deep left field. Back goes De La Cruz looking up and it's out of here. Pete Alonzo keeps on raking four home runs in the last three games. A two run shot and it's three nothing New York. Five home runs on the season that ties Brian Reynolds for the day. Thrown some Spanish and cho choice words at him. Jazz gets into one to right field and that's out of here. A home run for Jazz gets the Marlins on the board here in the top of the sixth. Well, that could have been that ghost fork that just hung o over the middle of the plate. It was something up at about 84. Yeah, that was that slider. It just didn't do anything but drop right in the hitting zone of Jazz. And Escobar flies this one to deep left. Back goes De La Cruz. Back at the wall. It's out of here. Escobar the other way. And he lets out a triumphant yell. First home run of the year for Eduardo Escobar. And the Mets now lead 5 to 1. Boy, he needed that. And he he's the man in town. Swing, high fly ball. That's hammered deep to left. Did Arenado do it? Yes, he did. Number 300 in Milwaukee. Well, you knew it was a matter of time. He was going to get it. Number 300. What a moment for, uh, for Nolan. Wow. First homer of the year. He's knocked in three runs tonight. And it There's a shot hammer to left. Yeah, let's go back. He's going to turn. The ball is off the top of the wall and gone. A J bomb for Walker, and the Cardinals are pouring it on. This is exactly what everybody has been waiting for this Cardinal offense to flip the switch. And Jordan Walker flips the switch on this right down the middle, elevated fastball. And well tagged, deep into left center. That baby's gone. Home run on a 3 2 pitch. Manuel Margot. Get comfortable with the pitcher's release point, and then a 3 2, he makes a mistake. Margot's second home run of the year, and he got into that one. And a shot back into center field. Ruiz back looking up. Goodbye. Home run off the bat of Brandon Lau. A three run shot. Lau's first home run of the year. It makes it a 9 0 game. The Randy Rosarena. And he shoots one deep into left center field with good carry on it. And that ball is gone. Randy Rosarena, the two run blast. His third and fourth runs batted in of the game. And the Rays now have an 11 to nothing lead.